Once upon a time in the kingdom of Everdon, there lived two princesses, Princess Isabella and Princess Mia. Despite being sisters, they were as different as night and day. Princess Isabella was born into royalty. She lived in a grand castle adorned with gold and jewels, surrounded by servants catering to her every whim. Her life was a whirlwind of extravagant balls, lavish feasts, and expensive gifts. She never knew the value of money because it was always plentiful. On the other hand, Princess Mia was not born into royalty. She grew up in a modest cottage on the outskirts of the kingdom, with her parents who were simple farmers. Mia knew the importance of hard work and frugality. Despite their humble circumstances, her parents instilled in her the values of kindness, compassion, and humility. One day, a grand ball was announced in honor of Princess Isabella's birthday. Nobles and royalty from neighboring kingdoms were invited, and the castle buzzed with excitement. Isabella was thrilled, preparing for weeks, choosing the most exquisite gown and jewels to outshine everyone at the ball. Meanwhile, Mia watched the preparations from afar, longing to attend but knowing she couldn't afford such luxuries. Determined to still celebrate her sister's special day, Mia crafted a beautiful necklace using wildflowers from their garden and a ribbon she had saved for months. As the night of the ball arrived, Princess Isabella made a grand entrance, dazzling everyone with her beauty and opulent attire. She was the center of attention, basking in the adoration of the guests and reveling in her wealth. Unnoticed by the crowd, Princess Mia quietly slipped into the ballroom, wearing her simple dress and the necklace she had made. She watched her sister from a distance, admiring her grace and elegance. However, as the night progressed, disaster struck. A fire broke out in the castle, spreading rapidly and engulfing everything in its path. Panic ensued as guests scrambled to escape the blazing inferno. In the chaos, Princess Isabella found herself trapped in a room, surrounded by flames. Despite her cries for help, no one came to her rescue. Just when all hope seemed lost, Princess Mia appeared, risking her own life to save her sister. With bravery and determination, Mia guided Isabella to safety, shielding her from harm. They emerged from the castle, both shaken but unharmed. As they watched the castle crumble to ashes, Princess Isabella realized the true worth of her sister's love and sacrifice. She realized that wealth and status were meaningless in the face of genuine care and compassion. From that day forth, Princess Isabella and Princess Mia grew closer than ever, cherishing each other's company and learning from one another. Isabella discovered the joys of simplicity and humility, while Mia experienced the wonders of luxury and extravagance. Together, they ruled the kingdom of Everdon with wisdom, kindness, and an understanding that true wealth lies not in riches, but in the richness of the heart. And they lived happily ever after, forever grateful for the bond that united. Princess Serafina, born into royalty, and Lily, a commoner from the village. Despite their contrasting backgrounds, fate had a unique plan for their friendship. Princess Serafina lived in a magnificent castle adorned with gold and marble, attended by servants at her beck and call. She was accustomed to the finest things in life, attending extravagant balls and feasting on gourmet delicacies. Lily, on the other hand, lived in a small cottage on the outskirts of the kingdom with her hardworking parents. They struggled to make ends meet, but Lily never lost her bright spirit or her kindness towards others. One sunny day, while wandering through the village market, Princess Serafina stumbled upon Lily selling handmade trinkets to support her family. Intrigued by Lily's creativity and warmth, Serafina struck up a conversation, much to Lily's surprise. Despite their differences in status, the two girls found common ground in their shared love for adventure and curiosity about the world beyond their own. They laughed together, shared stories, and discovered that they had more in common than they ever imagined. As their friendship blossomed, Princess Serafina introduced Lily to the wonders of the castle, showing her the grandeur of the royal gardens and the breathtaking views from the turrets. In return, Lily opened Serafina's eyes to the simple joys of village life, teaching her how to bake bread, tend to flowers, and appreciate the beauty of nature. Their friendship faced challenges along the way, as some members of the kingdom frowned upon their unconventional bond. But Serafina and Lily remained steadfast in their loyalty to each other, proving that true friendship knows no boundaries. Together, they embarked on countless adventures, from exploring hidden caves to picnicking by the riverbank. Through laughter and tears, they supped.